Yo, what's up, fam? How you been? How you doing? Uh, on some developing news, man. It seems like the death of some shade is an album that can be played, present. I don't know, man. There's a lot going, man. So I just like, okay, let me check out what we can find, and I found this. The Eminem's the the death of Slim Shady, a tale of two sides. Okay, hold on, what, what is this thing? Okay, Eminem Eminem's latest release, the death of Slim Shady, Coupe de Grasse, can tell a different story and paid in reverse, and maybe premises sequel. The album has sparked a firestorm of fan theories, particularly surrounding its concept and potential hidden narrative that unfolds when you flip the song order. Like Eminem said, it was a conceptual album when doing the public service announcement. Okay, let's go on. Damn it, so many S. Um, Eminem himself emphasizes the importance of listening to the album in particular order. Yeah, this is the tweet. Tweeting public service announcement. The Death of Slim Shady is a conceptual album. Therefore, if you listen to the songs out of order, that might not make sense. Enjoy. He hinted that listening to the album in reverse offers a different story. How did he hint that? Okay. But I understand the concept here. Yeah. Uh, the concept of like, if you listen it out of order, it's gonna be his because. Is a story that unfolds with each and every song that you listen to, you know what I'm saying? So, I don't know how he hinted, like, listening to the album in reverse offers a different story. Okay, maybe I'll find out more. Uh, the cryptic message inspired one fan, Piquara Boy 123, to offer a mind bending theory. The entire album tells a different story when played backwards. According to this theory, the death of Slim Shady chronicles a dark twist. Eminem, not Slim Shady, dies. Songs, dies. Eminem, not Slim Shady, dies. Songs like Somebody Save Me, for sure, Marshall's demise. Wild tracks like Conscious 2 and Breaking News depict Slim Shady taking control and revealing in the chaos he's unleashed. Okay. The story takes a sinister turn with trouble skate where Slim Shady supposedly drugs Marshall. This leads to reasons where Slim Shady speeds venomously over Marshall's brain and unleashes pure and un, un, underrated Slim Shady fuel on the world. Okay, here's how the story goes. Okay, I was waiting for this part because this is something that I saw. Somebody saved me. Okay, this is how the songs goes. It starts with Renaissance and Slim Shady buries Marshall and speeds on his grave. Marshall struggles while tied up. Okay, is that is a reverse? Oh so Slim Shady was the one who was speeding on Marshall's grave. But on the normal track list is Marshall speeding on Slim's uh, I don't know, man. I'm no, I'm no, I don't know. I, I'm kind of confused. Okay, let me just read it the way it is. Slim Shady buries Marshall and speeds on his grave. Marshall struggles while tied up. Slim Shady drugs Marshall. Slim mocks Marshall. Uh, Slim fully takes over. Slim tells Marshall he's, not, he's nothing with him, without him. Okay, he's like, okay, let me finish, let me finish. Switches between Marshall and Slim getting up the finale. Slim's shady side Slim's darkest damn Slim Shady's darker thoughts. References the Reaper coming. Slim dyes Marshall's hair blonde again. Whole things Marshall's on a tangent. Shady shows Marshall the chaos he has started. Uh, Slim Shady loves proving it wasn't a dream. Reference the story of Ezekiel and Creation Day symbolizes the birth of Slim Shady. A letter to Haley hinting at his end indicates Marshall's job is done. Uh, reflects on failures and the return of Shady. Guess who's back? Hints at Slim Shady's return. Somebody see me foreshadows Marshall's death. Oh, he dies. Okay, if you, you listen it this way, Marshall dies. If you listen it this way, 
Wait, what? Hold up, hold up, hold up. The way Eminem put it, like the way it was released, is the death of Slim Shady. Okay, Slim Shady dies, but this way Eminem dies, right? So somebody saved me, foreshadows Marshall's death. He is the uh, Ed Slim Shady's return, reflects on failures and the return of Shady, indicates Marshall's job is done. A letter to hail hinting at his end references the story of Ezekiel and creation symbolizing the birth of Slim Shady. Okay, Slim Shady loves proving it wasn't a dream. Shady shows Marshall the chaos he has started. Whole thinks Marshall is only intelligent. Slim Shady ties Marshall's hair blonde again. References the Reaper coming, Slim Shady's darker thoughts, switches between Marshall and Slim, setting up the finale. Tell, Slim tells Marshall it's nothing without him. Slim fully takes over, Slim mocks Marshall, Slim drugs Marshall, Marshall struggles while tied up. Slim Shady buried, buries Marshall and spits on his grave. This story paints a picture suggesting that Slim Shady, the dark, the dark persona feeling in his office, they must stage his own demise to unleash a new era of mayhem. However, this new story has the potential to flip the script again. Left of a clean hand, as the end of season 1 of a thrilling TV show, the story leaves room for side B of the album to come out and show Eminem emerging from the grave or oh, to take his revenge on Slim Shady. So, will we see side B? Could it be an retaliation against Slim Sh Slim's attempt to take over? This perspective is feeling and not exactly out of realm of possibilities. Uh, Slim Shady, Eminem attended Slim Shady's funeral in London, taking pictures with friends and signing autographs. Damn, it's good to see Eminem back outside. Okay, let's go back to this one because this is confusing. Like, Fuck every fucks out. Um, this is the correct order, right? This is the correct order. Slim Shady, Slim Berries at Marshall. The way that we, we saw it at first, uh, it was supposed to be the death of Slim Shady. But I don't see here on this list Slim Shady being buried anyway. I don't know because somebody saved me the way I listened to it it was like Eminem rapping as if he how he would have died if he didn't live the way he was living you know if he didn't change the way that he was living so I'm kind of confused Slim Shady died this is the album of Slim Shady dying but I don't see him dying anyway I would think it would, it would make sense if, okay, he is Slim Shady, spits on Marshall's grave, right? And then he for shows Slim Shady's death. And then it, Slim Shady comes back. And then reflects on failures and the return of Slim Shady, of Shady, indicates Marshall's job is done. And then a letter, hailing, a letter to Haley hinting at his end. That now Shady is back. I don't know if I make sense, man. I don't know if I make sense. A letter to Haley Hinton at his end. Reference to the story of Ezekiel and creation day symbolizing the birth of Slim Shady. Hints Slim Shady there, man. Hints Slim Shady's return. Nah, man. This is tripping me, man. But y'all let me know, y'all let me know, man, I'm gonna toss it to you guys, man, so that y'all can see what you can get out of this, because it's confusing the shit out of me, man. <laughs> Somebody who has, like, maybe a higher IQ than mine, man, please explain this to me, because I'm stuck right now. Slim Shady Berries, Marshall, and Spitz on his grave. Because I feel like if we do like opposite sides, then he is Slim Shady kills Eminem because in the beginning Eminem comes kills Slim Shady right but here dies Slim Shady 
because he can vary. Oh, for shadows, martial stairs. It's not bad, it just like shows that he's gonna die. I don't know, man. Stay, I'm still okay. Uh, okay, return of stone shade. Like, how does he return if he never died? That's the one thing that I'm asking myself, man. How does my stone shade return if he never died or never went anywhere? This one I'll understand. Like the twist being like uh, Eminem's retaliation against a time to take over, you know. This one I understand. Like, okay, you try to kill me, I'm back. But he, Marshall, never tried to kill Slim Shady in this explanation. Nah, I'm tripping, man. I feel like I'm tripping. For shadows, he just in shade of return of reflection figures and return of slim shade in case Marshall's job is done and later to healing, hinting at his end. Reference the story of Ezekiel and Christian Day, symbolizing the birth of slim shady, shady, loves screaming it was in a dream. Uh, shady shows Marshall the chaos he has started. Paul thinks Marshall is on a town and slim shady dies. Eminem's blown. Okay. References the Reaper card and Slim Shady is Dark Thoughts, which is between Marshall and Slim setting up the finale. Slim gets Marshall, tells Marshall is nothing without him. Slim fully takes over. Slim mocks Marshall. Slim drugs Marshall. Marshall struggles while tied up. Slim buries Marshall and spits on his grave. I man, I'm gonna leave it to y'all because I I don't know man. It's kinda confusing the fuck out of me. 